Jesus Land, a memoir, is a poignant and deeply personal exploration of Julia Shear's childhood growing up in a strict Christian family in Indiana during the 1980s and 1990s. Throughout the book, Shears delves into the complex dynamics of her family, her experiences with racism and homophobia, and her eventual journey towards healing and self-discovery. One of the most striking aspects of Jesus Land is Shears' vivid and evocative writing style. She paints a vivid picture of her childhood home, the various churches she attended, and the people in her life with an almost cinematic attention to detail. This allows the reader to fully immerse themselves in Shear's world and to gain a deeper understanding of the complex emotional landscape she navigated as a young person. Another key theme of the book is the pervasive influence of Christianity in Shear's life. She writes extensively about her family's strict adherence to the Bible and the intense pressure she felt to conform to their expectations. This pressure is particularly acute in the wake of her adopted brother's violent outbursts, which culminate in his being sent to a behavior modification school in the Dominican Republic. Shear's guilt and shame over her brother's behavior, coupled with her parents' insistence that she pray for his salvation, create a toxic and suffocating environment for her to grow up in. In addition to her experiences with Christianity, Shears also grapples with issues of race and sexuality throughout the book. She details her father's racist beliefs and his insistence that she and her siblings attend an all-white Christian school, as well as her own struggles with internalized racism and homophobia. These themes are particularly resonant in light of recent cultural conversations around systemic racism and LGBTQ plus rights, and Shear's frank and honest discussions of these issues add an important perspective to the ongoing dialogue. Despite the heavy subject matter of the book, Jesus Land is ultimately a story of resilience and self-discovery. Shear's journey towards healing is slow and fraught with setbacks, but she ultimately emerges from her difficult childhood with a renewed sense of self and a commitment to living an authentic life. This journey is exemplified in the book's final scene, in which Shear stands on a cliff overlooking the ocean and reflects on the beauty and complexity of life. This scene serves as a powerful reminder that, even in the face of immense hardship, it is possible to find moments of grace and beauty. In conclusion, Jesus Land, a memoir, is a powerful and deeply affecting book that explores complex themes of family, faith, race, and sexuality. Through Shear's evocative writing and her willingness to confront difficult truths, the reader is given a profound insight into the emotional landscape of her childhood and the ways in which she has grown and changed in the years since. This book is a must-read for anyone interested in the intersection of religion, culture, and personal identity.